Hello there. Have a seat. Thank you. What is your name? My name is uh, Maria Angelic. Okay, Maria. We're going to start the IELTS speaking section. I will record this speaking part of the test for marking purposes. To begin, I'm going to ask you a few questions on a general topic. Are you ready to proceed? Yes, I am. Okay, let's talk about school. Where do you go to school? I just uh, finished high school in my hometown of uh, Rouen in France. Right now, I am uh, traveling and preparing for university. What other schools have you attended? Well, uh, I moved from uh, Paris when I was 15, so I uh, had high school there. Additionally, I have uh, attended a nursery school and elementary school in Paris. I have gone to four school in total. Which was your favorite? Why? That's a tough question. Um, I enjoyed all of the schools I went to. If I had to pick one, I would choose the elementary school in Paris. I met uh, some of my best friends there, and the school had some of my favorite teachers. Do you enjoy school? Why or why not? Yes, I do enjoy school. I like seeing my friends and learning new things. I uh, look forward to weekends, though. What is your favorite subject? My favorite subject is uh, physics. I like learning about how the world works. Are schools different in your country? How are they different? The schools in uh, France uh, are very similar to those here. The one big difference is that children in France go to school for one year less. That is the end of part one. For part two, I will ask you about a specific topic. You will have one to two minutes to talk about this topic. You will have one minute to prepare what you are going to say. You can make notes if you wish. Now we will begin. Here's a card with the questions. Okay, the one minute is up. Please begin speaking. I don't watch uh, much television, uh, but one program I make sure to watch every week is a show called Nightwatch. It is a news uh, show which uh, talks about important issues going on in France. For example, a recent episode warned us about the dangers of skin cancer. Especially uh, in the south of France, the number of cases of the condition is exploding. Shows like Nightwatch are valuable because they raise awareness for issues like this. The show uh, is also very enjoyable because it is so balanced, uh, it presents both sides of the issue without bias. Another recent episode covered a big court case in Paris why the newspaper had clearly already decided if the defendant was guilty or innocent, Nightwatch presented both sides of the story while leaving the verdict to the jury and the court. Nightwatch has also won many television awards in France, as well as some international awards. Additionally, the show comes on each Sunday night at 9 p.m. and it makes for a perfect way 
to end my weekend. I learn a lot from the show and I feel better knowing that I'm up to date on the local and world issues going into the coming week. That's why I enjoy this program. Okay, that is the end of part two. I will now ask you some specific questions related to the topic of part two. We will now begin part three. What makes a good television show? I think uh, a good television uh, program should be interesting, exciting, and uh, should uh, keep the viewers' interest. Nobody wants to watch uh, a boring show. A good show uh, should also keep the viewer guessing. How much television do you watch? Mm, I don't watch uh, very much television, but I will watch a show once in a while. I watch uh, perhaps uh, 10 hours a week. That is far less than uh, a lot of people I know, including my friends. What television shows are popular in your country? There are uh, a lot of game shows in my country where uh, regular people come on TV and try to win prizes. My mother was on a game show and uh, she won a trip to Australia. They are definitely very popular. What impact has the internet had on television programs? Just to be clear, you are asking me uh, how the internet has influenced television? Yes, exactly. Hmm. Well, uh, I believe the internet uh, has had two different influences on uh, television programs. In one sense, it uh, gives television programs more viewers because the internet makes it easy to watch shows whenever a viewer wants to. However, in uh, another sense, fewer people watch the shows on television, which reduces advertising revenue for the television companies. What do you think the future of television is? That is a tough question. Uh, I think the future of television is uh, tied to the technology of the television itself. If uh, televisions uh, continue to get better and more desirable, then people will want to watch programs on their television. However, if uh, television technology stays the same, People may turn more and more to computers and the internet uh, for their television program needs. Great, that is the end of part three, and that is the end of the IELTS exam. Thank you very much for coming. Have a great day. You're welcome. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.